Hello there. So you might, might remember some time ago Rob showing a video on our coppering solution and he copper coated some mild steel. Uh, if you haven't seen the video, what we do, we put a link down below this video and you'll be able to watch that. But what we wanted to do was copper coat stainless steel, see if we could come up with a, some kind of method of doing that. And we have. So we've got an improved version of our copper coating gel here. And what we're going to use it with uh, is metal chloride. Sorry, iron chloride. So we've made up a, an iron chloride gel there as well. Um, so if you come in a bit closer, and I'll, I'll mix it up and we'll do it. Obviously we're using a, a metal chloride, so I'm just going to whack some gloves on. We've got the coppering gel in here at the moment. I'm just going to add some of our iron chloride to it. Give it a little stir. And I'll take a tissue. This, by the way, is just an insert to a, um, a thermos flask. So it's stainless steel. We'll coat that there. You might see we've been playing about with this. So there's a, a few that we've done before. Give it a bit of time to start working. Then I'm going to give it a going over with some wild wool. And it takes a bit of time to react, but you might be able to see it turning a nice copper colour there. Give it another go. Still, it's still reacting, it's still working, it's still coating with copper. You might be able to see the colour change. Just give it a final buff. And there we are, we've got a nice copper coating on that steel. Um, these are the ones we've done earlier. You can see a lovely long strip of copper there. Now it is quite important, I mean coppers, if you can strike copper in any metal, you can then start coating it with any other metal. But also copper has antimicrobial properties. So it's, it's quite nice to be able to copper coat surfaces in hospitals and kitchens and that kind of thing. Okay, thank you. that was just a quick update, thanks very much and normal service will be resumed.